What's going on? My name is Dave. Welcome back to my channel. Have I got a treat for you today, guys? Literally, it is a treat. What I have decided to do today for you guys is to make devil cupcakes. What they are is a really, really moist chocolate cake. The cupcake size. I'm gonna give that a go. I'm gonna jump straight into it. Let's go. start off with is some bicarbonate soda, some salt and some plain flour. What we've got again guys is a hell of a lot of sugar, some raw sugar and some brown sugar. We've got some butter and two eggs, make sure they're room temperature guys. We've got a quite a bit of cocoa as well as some buttermilk. We've also got some lukewarm water and some tap hot water. What we're going to do to start off with guys is to put in the uh, hot water into the cocoa. Give it a good stir, make sure it's all mixed together into a smooth consistency. What we're going to do is take the tap temperature water and mix it into the buttermilk with two teaspoons of vanilla essence. What we're doing guys is mixing up the two eggs, put the butter in into a reasonable sized bowl and what we're going to do is cream the butter and the sugar together. A few moments later. So now that we've creamed the butter and the sugar together, we can add the egg mixture. Make sure it's just all nice and mixed together. Don't worry about over mixing it, just so it is all thoroughly combined. So then we get the uh, difficult task of putting all the cocoa into the mixture. Make sure you get all of it out of the bowl and give it a good mix together. Again, making sure it's all mixed thoroughly together. So what we're doing now guys is getting the flour and the buttermilk mixture prepared. What we're gonna do guys is about a third at the time, mix them together, making sure there's no dry ingredients left. Try not to use the spatula I used guys, it was a terrible idea. Make sure it's a long handle one and your hands will get a lot less messy. So continuously making sure there's no dry mixture left before we add in the liquid ingredients. And what we get to do now guys, is to put it all into little patty cake. A few moments later. So job well done guys. That is about the height of the mixture. What we get to do is chuck it straight in the oven at 180 degrees on fan forced. Alright guys, so my first take at making devil cupcakes for you kind of worked out, kind of didn't work out. What did work out for me was cupcakes themselves. They turned out quite nicely. Let me show you what they look like. So guys, these are the finished products. They are mini cupcakes. Notice the dripping down the edges. That's what didn't work for me. The icing on the cake wasn't actually the icing on the cake this time. Didn't really work for me at all. I don't know what went wrong. I think it was a little bit too liquidy. Um, so it has all dripped down the sides and that's why I've only iced six of those cupcakes today. On the plus side guys, they do taste really, 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 really good. I am pleasantly surprised on how these cupcakes turned out. And if you guys wanted to give it a go or have given it a go, let me know in the comments below how you guys fared and how they turned out for you guys. In the meantime, guys, I'm going to be eating a cup. <laughs> 